Oh, it feels so good to be rich. Whoa, my name is Roy Betra, only known to those very close to me. Some call me Mark, some call me John, and some call me Clemens. Some even call me Clemenzo. It feels so good to be rich. If you're a poor brother, you have to go and taste what it is to be rich. Everything you want in this world is here. Oh! Welcome to my world. Welcome to Roy Veterans World. What about the container at the wall? Oh, well, that's a very good question. You know, I had a very long discussion yesterday with the Controller General of um, Apapa Wolf. Wow. And he made it clear to me that all the containers will be released soon. Wow, baby. That's good news. You know, I'm a very strong person. God, I was beginning to get worried. Yeah. And you know my brother Fred, he's on my neck. What? Fred? You told him about us and the money? No. No, but you know he gave me five million naira to start up something with. It's only normal for any elder brother to act about it. Well, that's true. And he has been asking about his engagement ring. I told him that soon he will meet my fiance, but it's kind of strange that my only elder brother has not met my fiance yet. Baby, you know, um, this relationship we're having is not um, for the now, actually. Because from the very first day I met you in the club with your brother, when he introduced us to ourselves, I fell in love with you immediately, you know. But sincerely, I would like us to conceal this affair we are having. The moment I clear the containers, sell the goods, I can now give you your profit and we are all happy. Then I can disclose everything to him myself. Okay? Okay, if you say so. So, are we going clubbing tonight? Oh, clubbing? It's okay. been long you took me to a club. I understand, but let me tell you something. Myself and your brother, we're always hanging out in the club together now. And always, you know oh. that he's always with me in the club. He Baby, he shouldn't see us together. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go to another club. You can tell him you're visiting someone. I just want to dance tonight. your mom I know <laughs> I know so how are you did you lose my number or something why would you mistake me for your mom uh, not exactly I just woke up on the wrong side of the bed they have been so busy seriously how can I not have your number oh oh that's okay babe yeah Nothing, I was just missing you. Where are you? I'm in front of your house. Oh, no, no. <laughs> no, uh, it will be better by, let's say, 8 p.m. Yeah, 8 p.m. Oh, okay, okay. Take good care of yourself, okay? Okay, bye, Mom. <laughs> Your mom? Yeah, my mom. She wants to see me and I made it clear to her that I'm not uh, available right now. You know, I'm with you. I have to spend all the time I have with you, you know. So I told her 8 p.m. will be fine. You know, it baffles me that your mom wants you to get married. 
Yet she doesn't want to hear a woman's voice in the background when she calls. What kind of a mother does that? Are you in any manner trying to insult my mom? No. Look, this is the 21st century. Christianity lives in this era and no more than medieval times. It's only a fool that will think you're still a virgin anyway. Oh. So, the fool here now is my mom, right? No, Roy. I only made a general statement. Why take it personal? Because you have just made me understand how you are going to keep fighting my mom when we get married. Roy! Thanks for the revelation. Get up. Roy, no! Get up! Roy! Get up! Get up. Roy, take it easy! Get up. Gave you money to set up a business and you did it. I did. But it folded. Please, can you come on tonight to come and talk to me? He listens to you. Mm -hmm. Tonight? No. No, no, not this night, Jane. I have a date. Mm -hmm. This guy, I met him two months ago. He's actually making me decide to give marriage another thought. Yes, he's sweet. His name is Clems. He's a sweet person. He's he's lovely. Maybe he's everything I want in a man and you know, you should meet him. <laughs> Not this night. I'll probably I'll probably come tomorrow. I was training. Thank God, thank God. All those girls, all these copper girls, I'm sure they're saving you. Hmm? Ah! Pandora! 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 Please leave! What's wrong with him, Pep? That was so good.
Okay. Yes, I got you water. Oh. Wow. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Do you know, I was actually thinking of how to book your water into the apartment, but you saved me the stress. I really appreciate it. But you, you didn't stay till the end of the training. Oh, yeah. I need to go to town to go talk to my mom on the phone. Okay. Yeah. Do you know that I haven't spoken to her for like three months now? Oh, three months? Yeah, three months. <laughs> and you know how parents feel when they haven't heard oh, their daughters for really long. They go. feel kind of unhappy. Yeah. So I need to go talk to her. Um, you mind I accompany you? Please. His obsession for me is increasing day by day. Please. How do I handle this? Okay. Alright. So. Let me finish with this now. I'll let you know, okay? Alright, alright. You know, but. I was missing you so badly, huh? Yeah? Yeah. It was beginning to hurt. I've missed you so much too, baby. You know how I do my thing. Just this new business that just came up, I've been so carried away with me. Just that along the line, I got crumpled. Wait, Mark. You mean you're doing business and you didn't inform me? I know exactly, baby. I I had an arrangement with the bank. I was supposed to get 10 million naira from the bank. Unfortunately, in the process, I don't just know how everything just flopped. <sighs> so, my original plan was to let you in into this business today. I wanted to tell you, you know? Mm. Yeah. Okay. So, what happened then? Uh, in the process, you know how bad you know how to do your thing. We promise you one thing. Before you know it, they are not giving you the money again. Yeah. So um, Mr. Val. Oh, Mr. Val. Look at this super thing I was talking about. Oh. Hello, Mr. Val. Yeah, good afternoon. Yeah, I'm so happy to get this call here. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, okay. It's done already. 16 liters of... Wow, wow. Okay, when am I supposed to do this supply, please? Next week? Oh my goodness. Okay. It's as good as done, Mr. Fowl. Yeah, it's as good as done. Oh, okay, okay. They were here. Yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, bye. Baby, do you know who I just spoke to? Mm -hmm. I just spoke to Mr. Val from Peck Insurance. He wants me to supply 60,000 liters of AGO. Baby, what is AGO? Diesel! He wants me to supply 60,000 liters of diesel. Wow. Baby, this is big business. Mm. And God's so good, I already have all my structures ready. I have my papers, everything is sealed and signed. All thanks to my friends, uncles, and to Razak. Who has made it easy for me? You know, I have all my papers at hand right now. Mm -hmm. I'm supposed to do supplies to many companies in this country. Mm -hmm. All the television stations, everybody, most of the hotels, imagine the kind of hotels I'm supplying. I'm supplying Protea, I'm supplying Shirati. Baby, you can't beat this. Even the trucks I'm supposed to use to do all these supplies and the Razak has made everything so easy for me. Baby, I'm so lucky. I just have to do all these supplies. Mm -hmm. Ah, baby. Do you know originally I'll be buying this gas for 190,000. So if I add all my expenditures, that is the hiring of the trail of the, of the trucks, you know, to supply the diesel and everything. If you calculate everything together, it will sum up to like um, a hundred, like uh, let's say 210,000. That's an additional to, uh, 20. And then I'll be selling at uh, 230. So you take. 
210 from 230. What do you get? You get 20 naira. Okay. okay. By the time you multiply 20 naira times 300,000 liters of diesel, baby, how much is that? That is already 300,000 naira. Baby, we are going to be swimming in cash. Wow, that's a lot of money, you know? You, you, you feel me? Baby, you know what? Okay. You have my full support. I think I'm game. I'm interested in this business. Oh, baby. You, 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 you can't imagine how happy I am right now. I actually planned to let you in into this business because you are the only person I can trust. So I want oh, us to be yeah. partners. Do you get? Yeah. I want us to be partners. But I have a little problem. The bank, they flopped my deal already. I need this 10 millionaire so okay. I can do the supply. Babe, don't worry. I'll see what I can do. I'm sure I can provide that. 10 million, right? Baby. Don't worry. I know I can always count on you. You're my baby. You're my baby. <laughs> You've always been there. I know you, baby. I know you can do it. They even go. Yes? Yes, it's what you see, Roy. Which one? So you never hear the breaking news? What news? Oh, okay. I, I don't forget saying I'm going to inform you. Well, I say you and in contract don't expire. What's the meaning of that? Madam, come. Say I didn't respect you for one thing. I for don't act. It's not because of say I don't the I don't the look, 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 all this while I see they come, they come. I don't need get interest for your for this thing. And you say if I don't say you get interest for me, but you don't want to tell me, sis. I know, I know. It's what to you! That's what I say. So, what do you think that 
you stand to gain? What do you think you stand to gain? Playing your silly games. Playing your silly games. Causing people pain. Causing people pain. In the end, in the end you will have to blame. You will have to blame. To blame, to blame, to blame, to blame, to blame, you have yourself to blame. To blame, 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 to with my very good friend, Frank. Bro, it's so nice. So pretty. That's <laughs> the That's Banks, my very good friend, the tallest man in the world. Oh, hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Wow. Roy, Roy. Please listen to you, so I'll tell you something else today. Roy, Roy. Roy, Roy. Roy, Roy. Roy, be fast, okay? Right now, we'll see that was planned. Now you remember. Is everything okay? <laughs> fine, everything is fine. I, I actually thought I heard some noise. No, that, that guy is fine. Nothing is up. He's okay. Everything is fine. How about you? Look, forget about that. It's fine. You see, I, I bought you this. Thank you very much. I'll see you later. Alright, bye bye. You're sure you're okay? All right, thank you, eh? Thanks. Thank you. Thanks for the juice. I, I appreciate it. Fiancee Mark and I had a long talk about our life today, you know, about our future. When is it coming to pay your bride price? Mom, we don't have money for wedding. Besides, we're not planning our lives, you know, financially. So the marriage will fall later. Wedding is free in my church. Moreover, you don't need such an elaborate wedding ceremony. Hmm? Mom, I don't attend your church. Besides, I don't want you in that kind of wedding. Anytime I look at your wedding pictures, I feel so ashamed. Laura, mm -hmm. that wedding produced you. Mom, enough. Can we talk about the reason why I'm here? Mom, please. My baby and I are adults, we know what we want. I'm all ears. And please, don't ever call him baby here again. Mom, please, I need your help. Mom, I need a loan to invest in Mark's business. It's oil and gas. Mom! Is a diesel supply business to AIT, MTA, Galaxy TV, Protea Hotel, 
And a lot of big firms, mom. See, listen. He has invested 13 million. I have three. So I only need seven. I know where you're heading to. Forget it. Good night, my daughter. Mom, please. Mom. Mom, please, you can't say no. Mom, you have to help me. I promised him. Mom, it's for my own good. It's for our future. Mom, please. Mom, I'm only asking for a loan. Are you asking me to give you your father's shares and use our house as collateral for a loan for you? This is not just a loan. For Christ's sake, what is wrong with you young girls? Why do you have to lose your common sense whenever you are in love? But you were planning to sell the shares and use the house as a collateral to raise money for your shopping complex. This is a better investment, Mom. This than, than buying lands and erecting structures to be rent out as shops and get paid annually. I hate to be a landlord now. I don't want to be a landlord. Besides, regular income is better than annual income. I am not erecting the structures for you. Sorry. You are not going to be a landlord. You are not easy, mom. You're not easy at all, Mom. You've always accused me of not doing something better with my life. Here's one, Mom. Here's one. What, what is the motherhood in it? Wait, what is the motherhood in it, Mom? Mom, Mom, this is not fair. You are right. Mm -hmm. I was only going to use the shears and the house. Mm -hmm. Anyway, not to worry. I'm your mother. I'm going to help you. Mm. Mm. Don't you better respect yourself. Allow me to I'm still Okay, madam. Ah, you see this lady? All this place like this connect here. Yes. Everybody here in Abega. I saw them within this top guard, this top guard, this top guard. In fact, this one called my plenty pass. You won't come back, Oga. I have no green here. Yeah, me. Huh? This lady does not look like a beggar. What are you saying? That's that's that. Madam, okay. I don't forget. This one get degree for begging. In begging different. Yes. So what happened? They say, eh? Hey, this one, in post band, he gets money with me, so the husband don't die. Then the boyfriend, huh? then the boyfriend, the boyfriend collects all of them property. So he can't come, make it come beg Oga. You don't say I say beg in the day. He can make it come beg Oga, make Oga find lawyer. We go help and collect everything. Back. Oh. Hey, yes. Wow. Hey. Um, help me take some of the things from the back. Yeah. Hey.
Yeah, who is that? Who is there? Hello, Emilia. Samuno. Well, I'm just checking on you. Oh, thank you very much. How have you been? Very well. Oh, okay. All right. Good night, my dear. Oh, good night to you too. I love you. Bumping into you, spending time with you, and then we go for lunch. Wow. Do you know that I was just about calling your phone when you made me understand that you were already in the premises? Okay. Um, baby, there's something that's been bothering me that I really want to talk to you about. Um, the, the other day, your friends, they called you Roy. You know, and then when they saw me coming, they just quickly switched. Why? And that was a nickname that my friends way back used to call me when I was in secondary school, you know. It was just a nickname actually, not like, uh, you know, something so big. So I just called them to order to stop using that name in your presence. Why? But I like the name. Really? Yeah. I know. It's just a nickname. You don't need such a name. Have a full cool. Okay. Have a cool. okay. Hello. Yeah, good afternoon, sir. Oh, Mr. Thompson. <laughs> oh, yes. Every necessary document and uh, every that thing is ready. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but actually, there's a limit I can go with anybody that wants to invest into. Um, yeah, there's a limit. I can't go more than 30%. Oh, yes. Okay. Mm, well, um, let me see. Um, seven o'clock, like seven p.m. will be fine. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yeah. Bye. Wow, baby. Mm. Now, Mr. Thompson from Central Bank of Nigeria. Okay. He has actually helped me get all the necessary license I need for my money lending firm. Oh, and he also made me understand that he wants his cousin to invest in it. Ordinary right now, I have 180 million naira on ground, but I'm actually targeting 200 million for a start. Yeah. And every one naira I give out, I get 60 cobo as percentage. Wow. Oh, yes. And it's so good to know that, actually it's a fair day to know that every other bankrupting companies in Nigeria, they're all at my doorstep right now, seeking for help. Do you know that the bank give them two naira, and every other firm like me, give 80 cobalt as percentage. You see why I'm going to blow? Baby, sincerely, any one of them I lend money to, I don't meet up with the right obligations or the deadline. I will quietly walk into their premises, and seize their businesses. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> You're smart. Yes, baby. You can count I on me. I am very, very proud of you. You're so business oriented and you're so hardworking and. And more so. I would like you to. Very important, baby. I would like you to invest in this business. Okay. It's something I know that is, is, is a big one. I will not close my eyes and see you miss out of this wonderful opportunity. Seriously, baby. Every other woman out there, all the big ladies in town, they are all at my doorstep too. They want to invest. But they are not close to me. I want somebody that is really close to me. You are my fiancé. Oh. If I can't do it for you, who am I going to do it for? Oh. 
So I will not let you miss out on this opportunity, baby. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> Give it to me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy to see you. All right, my brother, look at you. Man, you're so big. <laughs> Good to see you. Good Good to come, see meet. you. come meet my brother, Roy. Hi. Roy, my wife, Malaysia. Oh, how do you do? Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Is he your, your, your only brother, the, the Roy you talked about? That's him. Oh, really? Unfortunately, this is the first time he's meet, she's meeting you live. Oh, yes. yes. <laughs> All right, can, can we go in? <laughs> Please, let's go inside. Right. Where are your luggages? Uh, Okay, okay, okay. Um, Yami, just bring them in, okay? Oh, thanks. Thank you, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you a lot. That was a big one you've done for me. Okay. set up our businesses. Um, I, for one, have come back to set up one of the best law firms that anybody can think about. A law firm that will cater for uh, the kind of ills we have in our society, like intimidation by the police, harassment, brutality, uh, um, uh, um, uh, intimidation by landowners, house owners, to tenants, and nobody, has, nobody talks for them. You know, um, even worst case scenario, even the killings, judiciary that is going on, those things need to be addressed. Somebody needs to fight for the less privileged ones in our society, the ones that cannot pay good lawyers. Do you understand? That's why we're here. My wife, for example, also wants to open up the best clinic because she's a qualified gynecologist so that people will get good medical health care. And it's also needed here too. Wow. This is great. I'm so impressed by your vision, sir. We, you know, we, we, we really, really look forward to people like you to run this country. I'm impressed by your position, sir. I'd like to that. I'm going to believe him I stay here, hiding from the guy who doesn't want to understand that I don't want to date him.
I lost my luggage in the US. The police could not find the thieves. I lost everything. I just had my passport, our picture, and the $1,000 we borrowed from the bank. I, I tried to reach you. I searched everywhere. I searched for your name on social network. I searched for all the names I know you as. I could not find you. Trust me. I tried. Why, well, I did. I tried. I spent almost three weeks in the prison. I sold everything I've got just because of the money we borrowed from the bank. I was trying to pay back. Except for the clothes I was wearing at that time. But you are very that your family, this is your family, people, they are very weak here. Don't worry. I will stun them. Let them continue. I'm just very happy for the scholarship I got. Look, once I get to the US, I'll make an arrangement for you to come over. And when we now come back together, you'll see they'll be the ones coming for introduction, the ones who associate with us. Hmm. Amen. Anyway, I love you so much, baby. And I can never stop talking you. I love you too. You know that's okay. You look like you your small head. Hey! <laughs> I love it. And nothing will come with all of I just wish I could turn back the ends of time. So how did you meet him? I had a case and he was recommended to me. He was my attorney. I won the case and after that we started dating. Trust me, I didn't know he's your brother. How am I supposed to know? How? He didn't even say anything about his family. He never mentions it. He never likes to talk about it. The only time he even said something was that he has a brother who is Roy. But how am I supposed to know when you don't even answer the same son name? I didn't know. Trust me, Roy, I did not know. So what happened to the honey, honey? He used to call me. So the new old replaced the, the old one. In it. He will send it back.
wonderful mm -hmm. guy's place. He says he not just pop into my house and start to embarrass everyone you see. It's like a family person now. Okay? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I guess what? Now you're turning your head. She slapped you, right? Mm -hmm. Please don't stop. Expecting you. Come on, babe. Do I need to tell you I'm coming and give you every sort of info yeah. before I come see you? Of course not. Why are you my baby? Of course not. <laughs> <laughs> are you sure you I heard a female voice. Really? Yes, I did. Oh, Someone... oh, oh, um, I've forgotten I told you that my elder brother will be coming back from his stay with his wife. You did? Yeah, I did. Okay. I can't remember. But it's okay. I just hope you're not lying to me. Of course I won't lie. My three female cousins are around right now. Oh. Even my mom is around. Oh, really? Oh, they're going. I wouldn't want you to meet my mom in this manner. Seriously, I would like you to go home. Okay. Then I'll come over to your house later in the night to join you. Then we can have better time to talk things over. Okay? Okay, but I'll eventually meet her, right? Oh, definitely. Why? Okay. You definitely will yeah, It's okay. That's good enough, right? That's yeah. my baby. <laughs> are, you, are you sure you've eaten? Are you sure you're okay? Hey, I've eaten. Baby, I'm, I'm fine. Seriously. I'm good. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'll give you a call. Okay. Alright, Take care of yourself, love. Yeah. yeah. Bye. Bye. to tell you I've decided to move on okay so I've come to tell you how to pay my money when the goods are sold this is my account number you can pay it here when it's ready how much do I owe you five million naira I don't owe you a dime you've not contributed into this relationship and if it's not working so be it what yes this must be a joke right five million naira it can never and will never be an accountant to love you don't have a proof to that now get out of my house you hear me have this number. Yemi! 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 Run! Yemi! Run! Who's the woman that I, I saw crying, crying out? One of those ladies that always come to me for help. Probably because I didn't help her, that's why she's crying. I see. Anyway, uh, I came to pick up something. There was somebody going out. Okay. The harder I tried to realize that it's over between us, the more I just 
get so much and deeply in love with you. I just realized that I still love you. I still love you too. Very much. I know we can handle this and Lloyd we didn't find out. What happens to all the girls I see around you? Laura and Retta and even the ones I don't even know about. I truly don't want to believe that you suddenly became a womanizer the moment I left for the US. They love me. I don't love them. And now that you're here, they all disappear one after the other. You can trust me on this one, okay? I love you from the bottom of my heart, Emilia. Tamuno, you are obsessed with me. No. You are! Tamuno, Emilia. Okay, you want to do everything with me and for me. You even want to go everywhere with me. You don't want to see me with any man. And anyone who comes close to me, Tamuno, you attack them. You attack them. Tamuno, what happened to the good relationship we used to have? What happened to it? Why this sudden obsession you call love? Huh? Emilia, it... it Emilia, it is because I love you. Really? You see, I am not just talking about any relationship here, but getting married to you once we get out of this village. I said no. N O no, Tamuno. I repeat no, and I stand by it. Please. Jeez. Ah, Emilia, wait. of my husband's insults. I'm considering quitting the marriage. Twice he gave you money to set up a business and you squandered it. What do you expect? Huh? Instead of thinking about quitting your marriage, girl, you better man up and think about how to prove to him that you're not a lazy wife. You don't know how it sounds. Of course I do. You're not making money. That's how they sound. Anyway, Tango, you still have some money. There's this business my boyfriend and I are trying to set up. I can bring you into it. But you know I cannot really manage a business. You don't have to manage anything. Clem will do it on our behalf. It's a money lending business. Yes. Imagine someone comes to borrow 50 million and we say, for each one naira that makes up that 50 million, you get 10 kubo as gain. Mm. Now put this money together. Think about how much you will make. For me, I'm investing 10 million. But what I have is just 2 million. Oh no, 2 million is too small. You need to top it, maybe make it 5. At least 5 million. Don't look like that, okay? You have collateral. There are things you can do. There are things you can... There are ways you can get this money. Get it. How? I mean, I have to show proof before I can get a loan. You know I've never taken a loan before. You know where your husband's documents are, don't you? Good. Get them. Do what you have to do. When you start making money, you can explain to him and tell him the history of the money. But right now, you've got to prove that you're not a lazy wife. Thank you very much. You see why I run to you in times like this? Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah. 
Jesse. You know he's big for my own heart. As long as it takes us to sort out the businesses that we want to set up. Mm-hmm. I, I don't want to do any I mean, if I have a thing, this is the only time we've got our own house now. What's wrong with you? Look, we are going to start building our family very soon. You can't be staying under your brother's roof now. He's your younger brother. Don't you know he's supposed to be the other way around? At least if you get a small place, a small house to start with, you stay there and then get a small space for the office. I'm tired of staying in this place. I don't want to stay here again. If we have to get a place, it will affect the businesses we want to start up. Have you thought about that? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Wherever we get to move in and then we're from where we are, we'll start. It's not the same thing as going to stay in this place. This is not your brother's house. I'm tired of staying in this house. I don't want to stay here again. I don't want to stay here again. We'll get to small place, a small house. At least, husband and wife being together alone. Don't you understand privacy? Soon, our babies will be coming soon. Are we going to stay in this place? I don't want to stay here anymore. It's okay, my friend. I've heard you, man. I said I've heard you. You are not doing your face like I've heard you. I'm tired of this place. I want to see my back. Oh, man, leave me alone. I said I've heard you. Okay, I'll, I'll do something about it. seen other men. Mark, what are you talking about? Yeah, you're trying to tie me down with another man's child. Why are you accusing me of cheating? Shut up! Laura Williams, you are very, very wicked. You are the most wicked human being on earth. You are rigid, you are impervious, you are adamant, you are everything that should be called bad. That is what you are. And you get out of my house now. Yeah, me? Yeah, me? Mom, Mom, this baby is you. Take this bag of rice out of my house right now. Now, if I come back here and meet this woman, man, you are dead. Ah. Mark, get out of here. Mark, please. 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 What happened? What happened? What happened? What's the problem? 
happened to me? What happened? Look, Emilia. Are you very terminal? Oh yes. Terminal. He is planning to kidnap you on Wednesday evening after a past night ceremony. Kidnap you? Kidnap me? He even said that he did not have you. Are you kidding? <gasps> So you have to run. Run fast. Why? Why do I run to? You know. I've not gotten my certificate. How, how, how do I get my certificate? How? How? Look, see. I heard Kamino's dad disowned him. Yes, he disowned him because he takes hard drugs. Hey! He's going around. Jesus Christ. See, I, I've heard a lot about his stories. That was, that was why I avoided him. And I also heard he escaped from a psychiatric home. Is there a lie? No, 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 no. Hold on. I'm confused. Right now, if I'm you're sure about what you're saying, why didn't they align him to the, the camp? Like, yes, why did they do that? Because they thought he was well. Hey. They thought he's okay, but they don't know that Tamuno is insane. I agree with you. He's insane. Big one. But oh, Emilia, finished. no need for ranting and do? dancing. Oh my god. Look, what do I do? Look, what do I do? Look, you can help. You oh, can help. Calm down. You can help. Calm down. Look, pack your things. Get ready. I've got a friend in the, in the, in the town. Hmm? Okay. Where you can go drop them on Tuesday evening. Then after your ceremony on Wednesday, you get back to Lagos. You're not safe anymore in this camp. This, this is your friend you're talking about. Are you, are you sure I'll be safe? Are you sure I'll be safe there? Just, do you want to die? Mm. I'm sure you'd be better off dead than being in the camp with terminal. Please. Thank you. Tuesday evening. Get ready. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now mommy is here. Talk to me. Talk to me. Tell me what happened. Yeah. I had I had the insane. Oh no, why? Why? Why would you do this to me? Why? <laughs> Strength, eh? Let me take you to the car, okay? Mm -hmm. Sorry. Mm -hmm. You know what? You know what? My lorry, please. No! Sorry, don't do this to me! No! Ah! My baby! No, my baby! Ah! Ah! My baby!
You like this? Yes. Oh, now we have a home. <laughs> it's beautiful. Well, we lost the plans for the day. I know, but I can work with someone for now. Well, if you say so. Hello. That will be for the kids when they start coming. No. Um, no, that will be my room. I like the corner. This will be for the kids. That will be my room. Maybe you take this one, if you like. But that's one I can have that. Well, why don't we just stay in one room? What? Stay in one room? No. Come on, my shoes are too much. You start disturbing me. You tell me, baby, she'll be saying, I want to stay in one room. You stay here. No, I'm opposite. You want to be together? Maybe you bring the bags, right? I need to just see the room. No problem. Enjoy yourself. You can go, you can go. You got luck, see? So, how may I help you? Oh, you don't recognize me, right? I don't recognize a lot of people. Do me the favor. What is this? Those were my daughter's last words before she died. I got your address from your picture she left for me. My daughter died as a result of the way you tweeted her. Mr. Mac, I am not surprised when you said you couldn't recognize me after meeting you at the supermarket. She gave you 10 million. She sold all our shares and invested money into your business. I have come to collect that money back. Is that all? No what's funny? I don't understand why people just wake up in their houses these days. They go about other people looking for who to scam. I smell you. I smell you from a distance. Trying to obtain me by trick. And that will not happen. Young man, I am not here for jokes. Give me back that money. Then I will know what else to do with you. I can see the situation is really getting serious. And I will not allow that. I will not. Mm. So what will you do? Yemi! Yemi!
I still love you too. I know we can handle this and Lord we didn't find out. They love me. I don't love them. And now they're here. They all disappear one after the other. Once I get to the US, I'll make an arrangement for you to come over. And when we now come back together, you see they'll be the ones coming to for introduction, they want us to say to us. Tie and I've been trying so to fix it, but up. it's not working. Oh my goodness! Let me have a look. Thank you. Okay, this thing is not properly done. What's that? Oh, the oh the jack. Goodness, you're so messed up. Yeah. Um, anyway, would you like something for a change? Yeah, fine, fine. Yeah. Okay, Thank um, you if you would like something for a change, this is my house. Oh, I see. Yeah. Nice house you get. Thank you very much. Anyway, um, would you, would you come in? Let me just usher Okay, you no in. problem, no problem. Uh, but by the way, um, my name is... Uh, <laughs> no, no problem, no problem. <laughs> Lovely hands, lovely hands. Thank you. Um, my name is John Patrick. Emilia Coca. Emilia what? Coca. Emilia Coca? Yeah. Wow. So how do you do? And how do you do too? I do good. Me too. I'm doing good. So let's go inside. All right, no problem. Let's go. Is your car locked? It's locked. Okay, let's go inside. Let me get my bag, please. My bag. I can get that for you. Where's the bag? <laughs> I don't think I'll continue the journey. 
Well, we're going back home now. Well, um, I would say that's a very good idea. <laughs> so where do you live? At VGC. My, my dad's property. Wow, you live with your parents? My parents are dead. And I'm the only surviving child they have. They died three years ago in the plane crash. And ever since it's been me and myself against the turbulency of life. Wow. Yeah. I can imagine. All this why it's been just you. <laughs> You know, my dad would have made it easier for me if he had left me here with his wealth. But, he placed the condition. Yeah, he thought I wasn't going to get married because I hated men. So he placed marriage as a condition. And to keep me in marriage, he makes the man the one of the properties. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you know, dads can be very annoying. I've met you before. You're a stranger to me. And I think, I think I have to go now. I understand. You really must have gone through a whole lot of tough time with men. I think that you must have had a very rough time with men. Mm. Yeah, you're right. You know, I feel free telling you all this because you're, you're well to do. Look at, look at everywhere. Look at you. You can see that. <laughs> None of them really love me. None. No man has ever loved me. Okay. You know, we rich men's daughters go through this a lot. You see that they take your money and go get married to some local idiots out there. Or they ruin your life one way or the other. Trust me. <laughs> well, you know what? It never will. Never. And to think of other guys out there, other rich guys out there, hmm. they will kill you with infidelity. Ah. Hmm. So this is me, myself, my humble self, a single girl on the who's in here with a father's property. And uh -huh. I was actually out of town for like a year, so I couldn't run my dad's property, you know, because of my NYSA. Did you know that my father's company manager ran the business down? Yeah, he took a loan from the bank with it and he eloped. Wow. Yeah. That's devastating. Now the bank is on my neck. They are threatening to take everything from you. Everything. The estates. The seven plot of land in Ikoi. And it will succeed. If I succeed, I'll be ruined. 
I'll be left with nothing. Not even where I live. Everything. Everything. Okay, I'm in it. Everything will be taken away from me. It's you. okay. The estate. The seven plots of land in Ikoi, everything, everything will be taken away from me. It's all right, it's all right. Everything. Now you see. It's okay. Now you see why I use that word against the turbulency of life. It's alright. I understand what you're going through. I don't know if you can see it from my own perspective, but look. I have a solution here. I'm a businessman. What if I invest into this, your father's estate, so the bank cannot take it from you? We come to an agreement and we run the estate together. How are you guys? Right, you stabbed me at the back. Right? I didn't stab you at the back. Your sister should be the one, I think, should tell you what is going on. Roy, what do you have with my sister? Nothing. She's the one that has been hiding the father. She has been crawling into my bed behind you. Roy, 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 Roy. That's obviously not the right way to answer a friend which, you know, whom you offended. I don't know what you're talking about. Good. Roy, we have been friends for years and I'm ready to end it now. So be it. So be it. Okay. Where's the five million my sister gave to you? Your sister didn't give me any money. We made a trip to Dubai and that was what we did. That's a lie. I invested into his life. You shut up! Where's the money my sister gave to you? I don't want to ask you again. Roy, don't get me angry. Crying out loud, I did your sister a big favor for dating her. You, you, you big Yeah. Guys, come on. The guys, story is not money. You did my sister a favor! Yes! That was what I did! Chill, man! Come on, guys! Please, calm down! Can we just settle this amicably? What are you guys doing, man? These guys get out of my house. Look at... Yemi! You are calling Yemi! Fred, Fred, come on, Fred. Yemi. I will beat you! I will beat Yemi! I will beat everybody in this house! Yemi! What's Yemi? Come on, tell me shit! I'm going to fight my people up there! Get out of my house! Rubbish! speaking with have we ever met before my brother knows your daughter Laura so he gave me her number to call her I wanted to warn her about something but her number has been switched off so I had to get your number to call you warn her about what it's about her boyfriend the guy she's dating right now his name is Roy Bernard oh that is the same mark eh yes that guy, the only thing he does is to use girls, collect their money and dump them. He has done it to a lot of girls. He breaks their heart and just dupe them of millions of naira, then dump them. Anyway, it came late. Laura's funeral was last month. What? Vengeance is for God. So I'm very sorry about that, ma. Yes, I'm very sorry about that. Thanks for calling. 
Come on in. Okay. Oh, yes. 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 Okay. <laughs> so, how much are we looking at? 30 million. Wow, that's fair enough. That's fair enough. I can do the same. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> What, what, what will I do? Yeah. Okay, okay. Thank you very much, Mr. Kunle. Wow. Hi, Frederick. I'm good. And how are you, Priska? I'm fine. It's good to see you. Thank you. You have a fine office befitting your status, I must confess. Whoa. <laughs> what can I do? I'm a loud entrepreneur. I can't do anything less than this. Yeah. Anyway, I was just talking to Mr. Cooley on the phone shortly before you entered. I'm trying to buy up all their equipment. Very important. I'm trying to invest into this uh, entertainment industry. That is where the money really is now. You know? And besides, I'll be opening up a casino alongside the cinema where I'll first show all my movies. Hmm. Wow. Key. My dad thinks in that direction too. Because he's brilliant. He's intelligent. That is where the money is now. But you are not seeing any future in that. Of course there is a future in that. But I'm just cool with my fashion house. Fashion house you said? Yeah. Do you know that fashion is fast blending with entertainment these days? Yeah! You can go beyond your fashion house. All you need to do is invest into entertainment. It's a millionaire business we're talking about here. Oh yeah? Anyway, um, let's just drop this business, business, business shit for now. So, um, Priska, the very reason why I invited you, actually. How long have we known now? Wow. I think two months or thereabouts. Two months? Oh, my goodness. I'm sure it's, it's about three months now, if I'm not mistaken. Um, do you know you are a very, very beautiful girl? That's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody's serious about business. Okay. Um, tomorrow I'll take it up. I'll take it up tomorrow. Okay. What if they come for evaluation when my husband is around? Don't worry, I'll fix the date and time. Mm -hmm. Come sit. Mm -hmm. See, friends indeed. Sit down. I don't know why you should think it is clear. <laughs> yes. He's the one that gave me this opportunity. This is a lifetime investment. Thank you. What do I you? Guy, calm down. I mean, you have to calm down. What you should be after right now is how to get the money you collected from your sister back. You see, you see, left for me, I will still subject dialogue. <laughs> dialogue? Banks, you want me to calm down after Roy has betrayed me? No, huh? No. I can't just let it go. I cannot just let it go. Look, Fred, all these plans you have right now will only lead you to jail. And you know when you're in jail, there's no way you can help your sister. Banks, I want to go to jail. Oh, come because on, Fred. I want to hurt Roy more than that five million naira. I'm ready to go to jail. If hurting Roy will take me to jail, then I want to be in jail. Fred, Roy is our friend. See, can you forget about Roy? Please, this flower and the other one, which one do you think is better for that house? Look for me, I will prefer this because it's colorful and behind your house some lovely design. this one doesn't go fast.
you're not supposed to know our new home. I, I really wish you didn't have to know where we stay now. Over between us. I I don't want to ever see you again. When I look in those eyes, listen to those words, I see the Melissa that loved me years ago. You still love me, Melissa. You have to live now. Really? Oh, stop. You have to go. Boy, stop it. Stop it. Still feels like our first night together. I wish I could stay till tomorrow before we return from the You have to be Yeah. Let's get to see. Yeah. Um, Jane will get us as soon as the loan is approved by Monday. Okay. Yeah. Whoa. Fifteen million. Yeah, this is fair enough. Okay. Um, business is business. Let me get some contract papers so you can do some signing. Okay. okay.
You know? I think Ray is in some kind of trouble. Trouble? Mm hmm What kind of trouble? You know, last night when I was with him, he had a call and um, somehow the, the, his phone was loud and I could hear the other person uh, at the other end. You know, it was a lady's voice. I, she was going on cussing him and cussing him. Then I could hear Laura is dead. Laura is dead. Which now makes me wonder. And when I asked him, he confirmed that yes, that Laura is dead, but it's, she died of, a, of an accident. And that beats me. I, I was wondering if Laura truly died, how come Roy didn't mention her death to us, knowing fully whether I were close to her? Oh, may have so rest in perfect peace. My heart truly goes out to her family and her loved ones. Her is dead. You know? Well... Like I was saying, the person was going on and cursing him and he, the person also mentioned money and I said that he was going to die as a result of money. You know? When he got through the call, I asked him. I said, are you owing anybody? He refused. Are you in some kind of trouble? He vehemently denied it that he's not. But I still have my doubts. <laughs> Roy is an adult. If he says he's not in any trouble, fine, we should let him be. I'm sure he can take good care of himself. Ah, Leila. This is strange. and then I'm kind of behind schedule. Okay. You know Jane, Jane A.K. Mm. Senior Jane? Yeah. Oh, I yes, remember. Yes, yes, yes. I'm actually rushing to meet her. Okay. Yeah, I have a meeting with my fiancé and then we need to go together. You know how it is now. I'm fiance. so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm fiance. so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I... Is that your car? <laughs> You're a big woman. Hmm. You are doing really I good. I won't say that if I, you were me, cause why? <laughs> no, I can't say that I'm so with the bank. Oh well, okay. So what are you doing here? I actually came with my man. Was it to see the lawyer?
Are you are you married? Ah, no, not yet. Um, his name is um, John Patrick, and he's an investor. Uh huh. Two weeks ago. Whoa. He's a nice guy. He wants to buy my property back from the bank. Wow, you yeah. seem so in love. That's <laughs> nice. Um. Okay. Let me, let me to him. I. Here. Yeah. Um, where is he? Oh, okay. Uh, um, you know what? It's it's no. Um, I'm actually behind schedule. I'm in a hurry. Um, but I will see you some other time, and then you can introduce me. Let me give you my number. Okay, let me just. Um, okay, okay, let me just. Yeah, six four two nine three one five four. All right. Okay. Save it. All right, darling. I'm gonna call you. So I had to help bring you out. A dish? Yeah. I got myself messed up, seriously. Oh, okay. So, um, who, who's the lady? Oh, uh, my stomach is still there. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. I actually wanted to introduce you to her. What? Oh, oh, we can always do that somehow. All right, no problem. Let's go, let's go. Okay. Barrister, this is Mr. John Patrick. Oh, John Patrick, how are you? Yeah, the friend and investor I told you about, oh, remember? Oh, oh, okay. Mr. Nice John Patrick, the agent in charge of the estate. Barrister, I've briefed him beforehand and we're here to see how we can work that out. All right, um, let's just proceed. Yeah. I'll give you in details how the transaction between us and Trust Shield Bank, how it went. And also, the warning document the court gave us for defaulting. One minute. Am I supposed to go through the whole of this file right now and as in now? <laughs> Unless you want us to reschedule the meeting. Oh, of course not. We, can, we cannot reschedule any meeting. I will have to take this whole file to the house and go through them properly. Good. You see, those files with you are the company's files. You see, with that, you know everything about the company. No problem. I will get back to I have a call. Oh. Hello. Yeah, speaking. Okay. I'll join you right now. Barrister? Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, this is your Patrick? Yeah. All right. It was nice meeting you. Okay. Right. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Jane, you know you're looking very official. No, 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 it's a good thing. It's, it's actually a good thing. I'm, I'm happy. My husband asked me where I was going to. I told him I was going to learn something. Yeah, that's the spirit. You know, in order for him to recount all the abuse and insults that he gives to you, you need to take him by surprise. That is exactly my plan. Mm. Oh, as soon as I start making my millions, he will know I was never a lazy wife. Hey, hey. somebody is ready to make money! Yes. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Hello, baby. Hi. How are you? It's good. Yeah. This is Bennett. Good morning, sir. Good morning. I'm so sorry I kept you guys waiting, actually. I'm just coming from a cool hotel and suite where I went to meet with um, Senator Razak Bello. We had this uh, discussion concerning the contract is about starting up with Bay, okay? Mm -hmm. This is even the document right here. We started soon. Uh, maybe what about the lending firm? 
Okay, okay. Everything is in process actually. On my way from the hotel and suite now, I had to stop over at a place where they went to show to me. It's actually a bigger office space. That is what I need for the lending firm to kick off fully. You know, when this whole thing starts running, I'll have to employ a lot of staffs. And this place will be too small for all that. Um, baby, talking about staff. Yeah. Um, you see Jane, um, she actually would, I would like it if you give her a job. You know, I mean, anything at the office, it, it, it would really be appreciated. We just need something that would make her leave the house every morning and okay. go back. You know, she's an abused wife. Oh. I'm so sorry about that, Jane. No, okay. I'm sorry about that. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, I want you to be rest assured that the moment this uh, learning friend kicks off, you will be the first person to be employed. That's guaranteed. <laughs> wow. <Yeah>. Thank you, <laughs> baby. Thank Anything you. for you, honey. <laughs> and also, I have um, a very big surprise for both of you. Okay. Yeah. What is it? <laughs> okay. We have 250 million naira on ground now, and we have five companies waiting to borrow money. That's a lie. The problem right now is how to get rid of these two idiots. I have an nasty business to focus on. Confusion, commotion, breaking the rules, bending the rules of engagement as the victims fall for the false arrangements. Hearts are broken, all wounds are open. As vengeful hearts, you live in your trail like a tale, but it seems you don't care. You get your hands on the loot and unwilling to share your high on speed of greed as you carry out your. 